you surprised a few people out there today, but did you surprise yourself? Most definitely, yeah. The, the goal for me today was to try and qual uh, qualify for the Commonwealth Games for Wales next year. So to actually qualify for the World Championships in the summer is just unbelievable. I can't believe it myself. I mean, did you think you had that sort of performance in you? I mean, you, I think you warmed up with a park run and running the half marathon in the left knee. Are you surprised by that time? Yeah, like, I knew I could get close to 216, but given that it was my first marathon, I never really knew what I was capable of. That was the goal for me, but to run 214 and be the first British athlete home is just unbelievable. There's a lot of first-time marathon runners on the course today, but none are going to the World Championships this summer. What does that mean to you? It means, yeah, everything. Like, like tr training is hard and you do a lot of it on your own, so to get rewarded with something like that is just great. Um, what's your? How did you get here today? What was the? Did you did you come by tube or train? Obviously, you went off the mass start with everyone else. You didn't. There was no sort of bells and whistles for you. How was your? How's your morning been? Yeah, the, so I woke up at 5 a.m. this morning. I caught a tube at quarter to seven this morning from uh, London Bridge. They got to Blackheath at about half past seven, and then I stayed there until the start of the race. And yeah, it just took off from there really. And as you were going around, did you start to feel like I'm in this now? I'm in, I'm in contention. Or when did you know that you were going to be top Brit? Well, I started quite conservatively because it was my first marathon. I didn't want to get too carried away. The goal for me was to run under 2.16. It was never to be the first British athlete home. So once I got to halfway, I started to make some ground on the lead of British men. And once I started to get in that pack, it was running with guys that I really look up to. So I started to feel good. And all of a sudden, before I knew, I was starting to pull away. And it was I was working hard with Robbie Simpson at one stage. and. We managed to pull away and I just, yeah, I can't quite believe what's happened. And what have been the messages from friends and family back home watching on the television? My phone has buzzed a lot. I haven't looked at it yet, but yeah, it took me a while to go through them later.